and welcome back guys and in this video we have sourced the holy grail yet again uh, if you checked out our last video we did open up some um some battle of legends chris revenge which i mean seemed to be the hot hit I minute mean, just with everybody and um, you know looking for those starlights so we did end up getting another two booster boxes we've opened up i think just over a case now maybe just under a case um shout out to total cards i'll leave a link in the description if you guys want to check them out just in terms of um, picking up some booster boxes some sets they're just some really cool stuff throwing some free stuff as well if you spend over a certain amount some cool lanyards um as you can see there you get a little lanyard with uh which each of your purchases over i think it's 40 pound really really cool some cool anime on that as well lash ketchum um, Yugi Moto, some Digimon in there, some really cool stuff on the lanyards. So one, another little lanyard there, two, uh, some sweets. Again, some information, some invoices, information in terms of what they sell as well. You know, upcoming booster boxes, 5% off in terms of next orders. Really, really cool. Definitely check out Total Cards, guys, if you're interested. Um, some stickers as well. Um, and your keychain it's cool you your keychain again shout out to the cards and that's the booster box i mean they come really nicely tightly packed together as well and um, really good service so i've got from these guys from the past so shout out to total cards but as i said we have picked up another two boxes of battle of legends chris revenge i mean <laughs> we, we pulled up everything bar starlight guys um we have pulled um, access code, we've pulled I mean, everything else, Toon, Black Luster, everything you can think of we've actually pulled at this stage, bar that elusive, um, that elusive Starlight. So I have picked up these <laughs> two boxes, this is probably going to be the last purchase I make of um, Battles of Legend, Crystal Revenge, just because they're, a, they're you know, they are quite pricey and listen, these things have got ridiculous ratios. So listen, let's crack through this. See if we can pull one of those starlights. And um, if not, listen, it's enjoyable just open up these, these boxes anyway. Blackwing Green, Shining Star, Trim Kakata, Todoroko, the Earth Pole Star, Odd Eyes Rebellion Dragon, and nice, Artemis the Magis Magistus Moon Maid. Nice. Um, I'm gonna sort of crack through these relatively quickly, guys. I mean, if you haven't checked out our last video, we did open up, I think, Four or six boosters of um, Battles of Legends. I think we pulled uh, we pulled the tune Black Luster. We also pulled um, the Axis Code, which is really, really nice as well. And um, Toon Terror, Crystal Beast, Topaz Tiger, and a Toon Page Flip. Nice. And um, but yeah, I mean the um, the ratios and the Starlights are, are are crazy. I mean, I've seen the Exodia. This is the head of Exodia going for four five hundred dollars. Crazy cash. Um, you know, limbs of Exodia going between sort of um, two to three hundred to three hundred dollars as well. Advanced Crystal Beast, Topaz Tiger, not the secret. Um, and I mean, listen, I wouldn't really be buying them. I don't think many people would be buying the trade if you're if you're into that. And absolutely, listen, no problem. But for me, it's more about um, just owning the card, adding it to my collection. You know, like many of us, just, just having the nostalgia. And um, let's see if we can pull one. Two bookmark. Nice. Um, but yeah, ridiculous price. Now, the question is, will they hold value? I'm not entirely sure. If you look at some of the ghosts in the past, ghost rares, you know, they've gradually dropped over the while as well. So, um, I don't know. What do you guys think? Comment the, uh, let me know below in the comment section. Evil Twin Lila. Nice. Let me know in the comment section, do you guys think they will drop in value, the starlights? And if so, are you going to pick one up? Would you pay uh, four or $500 for uh, a head of Exodia? Let me know, I'm, I'm, I'm intrigued. Blackwing, Sorocco the Dawn. And a Fusion Destiny. Yes. Um, oh, come on. I mean, if I could pull any, any limb of Exodia, this would be a win. Crystal Beast, Amethyst Cat, Dimension Dice, Crystal Skull, Senko, and a Doodle Beast. I mean, I got so many Doodle Beasts in the last video. 
Um, I think I've got maybe two or three times it over on the, on the play sets. Um, anyone wants one? They are. DD Crow. Um, the Jitsu Wars. Another Blackwing. Dino Tank. Another Artemis the Majesty's Moon Maiden. Nice. What else we got? Thunderball. Toon Harp Lady. Nice. I mean, these aren't really short sure printed, but I mean, anyone who's who's OG like me, a little bit of Toon Harpy never went wrong. Blackwing, Gadget Box, Cool Card, and the Secret Chaos Creator. Um, halfway through on the left hand side. Let's crack through these. Um, but yeah, as I said, on the Ghosts in the Past, the Ghost Rares have gone gone up. I mean, I picked up one recently. You guys may have seen my, one of my videos, The Dark Magician Girl, Ghost. Absolute beauty. Um, but again, I, 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 I didn't pull any actually from, from Ghosts in the Past. Didn't get lucky. Um, another doodle box. Didn't get lucky, so I actually held off and managed to pick up that Dark Magician Girl, you know not ridiculous price and um, but again I'll, I'll add that to my collection g golem crystal heart stonehenge the blackwing hot eyes selene nice let's, uh, let's sleeve up the selene beauty selene queen of the master magicians nice pull. one of the short prints i believe from the set what else we got? Another Crystal Beast, Sapphire Pegasus. Another Crystal Beast, Amber Mammoth. Curse Reflection Jewel. Blackwing. Gale the Whirlwind. And a Blackbeard. Got plenty of Blackbeards as well in the last set. But can we get that Exodia piece? Rainbow Ridge. Amazonas Hall. Royal Strait. Prime Dragon. Number 100, New Royal Dragon. Okay, in the second half, what can we pull? Rajin, the Breakable Star, the Tomb, the Blackwing, Diddy Crow. Oh, nice. Toon, Blackluster Soldier. I mean, that's a pretty good opening. Uh, a little bit heavy on the bottom. <laughs> Don't think it that much of a chance in terms of a good PSA grade in there in terms of the bordering. A little bit thick at the bottom, as you can see. Uh, some widening at the edges. Great, actually, this is a very poor, but again, I think I said this before in terms of the European prints. Um, there's tend to be a lot of whiting actually, and um, whenever they're packaged together and manufactured or shipped for that matter. And um, the, uh, the European editions definitely tend to have a lot more whiting on the edges. Chaos, Avandroid Saviour, she got him, Battle Sleeping Spirits, and another new one. Give us one of those exotic pieces. Blackwing, Sorocco, Gadget Box, the Crystal Beast, Blackwing, and a Fusion Destiny. So yeah guys, I mean, what, what, well, I mean, what I'm actually intrigued is, has anyone, have any of you guys got any luck in terms of pulling any of those Starlights in the set? Um, because God, they're hard to pull. G Gollum, Invalid Gollum. Um, it's so hard to pull. Uh, I'd love to know what the ratios are. I haven't actually done much research on it, but I mean, I'm assuming they're they're quite difficult. Um, emblem, chaos space, nice. Let's sleeve it up. Pretty good box opening so far, you know what I mean? Celine, two black luster, and a chaos space, two flip uh, page flip as well. Um, definitely good at pack up. Dynabase, Dororoki, number two ninja, Shadow Mosquito. What else? Come on. <laughs> I was convinced in the last video, guys, that we were going to pull. Um, we were going to pull at least one piece. And then I think I've seen somewhere actually is one or is it one Exodia piece per two cases, which is like 24 booster boxes. So I uh, definitely wasn't feeling as optimistic when I heard that stat. Okay, last three boxes. What could we pull? Advanced Dark, the Blackwing, Oily Cacadia, 
token collector, and advanced crystal piece, ruby carbuncle. Um, two packs left. Can we pull a little beauty in here? Tiffany monster, I've seen the monster anyway. Blackwing, dimension dice, G Golem Pebble Log, Salmon Great Circle, and an all ice. Ooh, sorry, second last pack. Rajin, Chaos, another Crystal Beast, Crystal Beast, and an End Shuffle. Nice. Any of those, um, Jaden, Yu GX followers, and the Elemental Heroes, who didn't love them. Dragon Ants, Last Pack, Double Bok, Dino Bass, Dream Shark, and the secret is Advanced Crystal Beast, Amethyst Cat. Cool. Alright guys, one box down. Let's crack into the second. Let me get set up, we'll be back in two seconds. And we're back. Alright, let's crack into this. Last booster box of Battles of Legend Crystal Revenge. In that first half, guys, just while I was getting ready for this second booster box, a little reminder. We pulled a few other things, I'll show it at the end, but again, we pulled then Shuffle, Tomb Black Lost Soldier, Chaos Space, and a Celine. Pulled some of the cool stuff as well, but um, we can show you at the end. We'll do a little, a little, a little recap. Um, let's crack into this video, uh, this, this last booster box, and let's see if we can. Uh, Pull that starlight. So you've probably seen most of the set already, guys, in, in, in some of the videos we've done. So I'm gonna crack through this relatively quickly um, and see if we can indeed pull that uh, starlight. It's just a little bit refocus. In fact, there we go. Much better. Just changing the focus on it, guys. So let's crack into this. Um, Advanced Crystal Blues Ruby Carfunkel. Pull that in the last booster. Um, but I mean, listen, I mean, if we don't pull Starlight, I, I would take an access code. Um, I would take another Selene, in fact, another Heratic. Definitely have actually had some people ask me about the Heratics. Really seem to uh, to like them. Amazonas, another Amazonas. Fight for a patchwork and uh, Crystal Bees Supreme Sapphire Pegasus. Um, but yeah, definitely a few people ask all right, about the um, about the erratics. G Gollum, another G Gollum, uh, Blackwing, Hot Eyes, and a Kai Moker. I'm not even going to try and pronounce that. A Kyoki Mirror Supplier. Okay, what else we got here? Definitely harder to open these days. Remember, as a kid, these things used to be so much easier um, to open them in. Absolute dog's dinner of that pack. Uh, Doddle Box, Crystal Beast, Curse Reflection Doll, G Gollum, and another Blackbeard. I mean, I'm not gonna lie, I'm not the biggest of fans of, of the Blackbeards. I think Konami could have put some, some other stuff in there in terms of secrets. Rainbow, Amazonas Hall, Stonehenge, pretty cool, that's dark, and another doodle. Or doodle, I should say. What else can we pull? So we've opened, I think this will be our sixth booster box. The Crystal Beast, G Column Pebble Dog, Salmon Grace. Oh, yes. Access Code Topper, nice. Again, guys, the, um, the center is just it's a little bit meaty at the bottom, you'll see. A little bit top to about the top back again that little bit of white I told you about with the European prints you do get that little bit of white and centrance is a little bit right to left as well but listen I'm not gonna complain another access code talker really really nice happy with that so I mean listen we've, we've opened two boosters I think in, in, in the last few videos guys for those of you who haven't watched this um, we pulled an access code, we pulled um her cold nice. We pulled um another black ring number number one. Um we pulled one access and we pulled one two black luster from uh four four boosters. So we pulled the set already from two, so listen, I'm actually really happy with that. Crystal Beast and a Doom Kaiser Dragon. Nice. Um so listen, I think we can actually consider this a really, really good success. 
with the access code has definitely made this booster. But can we get, Tinter? Nice. Can we get one of those starlights? Royal Starlight Slasher. Um, to really complete it. I mean, as I said, guys, we've opened up six of these booster boxes now, so half a case. I think the ratio is one Exodia piece per two cases, or every two cases. So it is quite hard to pull them. Advanced Crystal Beast, Cobalt Eagle. Um, it is quite hard to pull those pieces. I mean, if you land an Exodia head, you're talking, as I said, maybe four or $500. Currently, Dimension Dice, Crystal Skull, Senko, Raijin, you know, this looks like a, like a you know, blue, um, Black Skull Dragon. Um, Evil Twin Lala, or Lila, I should say. Um, Toon Harpy, Blackwing, Lee Crow, such a good card, and uh, Allies. I think this is our last from this side. Avandred, G Golem, Battle of Sleeping Spirits, another Blackwing, and a Kai Mao. The one that we can pronounce. <laughs> um, right, second half, can we pull? Some sweet advanced dark, gadget box, total collector, another Doom Kaiser. Black Queen, Gravity Balance, Crystal Beast, Amber Mammoth, Toolbox, and another advanced Crystal Beast, Topaz Tiger. The Crystal Beast I must say are pretty, pretty cool in this set. Definitely really nice secrets in the set. Um, it's just the ratios are just so difficult. Curse Reflection Doll, Crystal Beast, Sapphire Pegasus, and the Royal Ice. Phantasma Dragon. Um, yeah, the uh, the ratios are just are, 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 are really difficult. As you guys have seen, as we've gone through these, um, really, really hard to pull anything of value, to be honest, unless you hit one of those access code talkers or one of the Toon Blacklist Soldiers, or Chaos Space. Royal Strait, nice. Had one Queen, King Knight, and Jack Knight. And number two, Ninjutsu, Shadow Mosquito. You have about five, six packs left. For me, right, if I could pull one more of those, um, you know, one of those secret rares, one of those nice ones, a Toon, or even another Selim, um, another Tyranno. In fact, in the first four booster boxes we opened, you'll, you guys will see we opened a lot of Doodle Beasts. So, I am happy to see the end of those. Crystal Beast, and the Blackwing, Dynabase, and the secret is Advanced Crystal Beast, Emerald Turtoise. The last few packs on the left hand side, can we pull a Starlight? Toolbox, Chaos to Devilus. <laughs> Uh, Blackwing Full Armor Master and another advanced Crystal Beast, Ruby Carbuncle. We got two left on this side, or on, on the last side. Dragon Nails, Doddle Book, Amazonas Hit Spring, or Hot Spring, Dream Shark, and the Secret Advanced Crystal Beast, Cobalt Eagle. Three packs left of this two booster box open. Opening of Battle of the Legend, Crystal Beast, another erotic, nice. Road Coal, Dice Dungeon, another Advanced Crystal Beast, Sapphire Pegasus. Of the in demand set of 2022, along with Magnificent Mavens, I, I do think that was definitely a really cool set, and um, particularly the Ultras, you know, um, the Ultra Ferrer Rares. I'll definitely do a binder uh, review one of these days, guys, and I'll show you the Element and Hero Neos. Ultra Ferro Rare Paul and the Secret Evil Twin Key Sickle and our last pack of Battle of the Legend Crystal Beast First Edition Dark Side of the Rainbow. Can we pull something nice? Axis Code Talker, Celine, Two Black Luster Soldier, Chaos Space, any of the Toon Flip cards, um, but can we pull a Starlight? Come on. Solomon Great Circle, Age Imp Chain. Black Wind Full Armor Master and an Advanced Crystal Beast Amethyst Cat. 
so there you have it guys um, let me just do a quick recap in terms of what we managed to pull in two booster boxes give you guys an idea of what you can expect to pull um, if you guys were to buy this set so give me a couple of seconds and I'll come back and we're back so guys just give you an idea again if you're going to go buy some of these Battles of Legend Crystal Revenge booster boxes what I will say is they're really really hard to pull these starlights so I think the ratios again are one starlight per, per two cases so that's what, 24, 24 booster boxes? Um, to give you guys a guide, I've opened six of these booster boxes. I have pulled um, two access code talkers. I've pulled two balloon, uh, two black luster soldiers, and I've pulled a range of these things from End Shuffle, Chaos Space, I've pulled two Selenes as well, and a range of the full suite of cards. Some sort of bulk in here in terms of ultras. But as you can see, some of the secrets in here I've pulled. Um, what you can expect a lot of duels a lot of crystal beasts as well and um, heraldics are you know sort of nice to pull the tune flip page um, and also the tune terrors there's a lot of cool tune cards in here bookmark you can see as well fusion and um, destiny but overall really good set from these two boosters i managed to pull all of these um the ultras and um, sort of bulk some nice bulk in here as well as i said you can get tune terrors and some heraldics secrets tend to hold a little bit of value but really from these two boosters i managed to pull a selene an end shuffle chaos space tomb black Luster soldier and probably the, the short print in terms of the secret rares in the set and access code talker so guys listen i hope you enjoyed the video um, really really enjoying these um, these box openings if you enjoy them too please do subscribe comment share uh, really does help out the channel uh, let us know if you're liking these, these you know this, this Yu-Gi-Oh content and if there's anything else you want to, uh, us to open in terms of Yu-Gi-Oh product let us know in the, in the comment section and thanks again for watching we'll see you in the next one oh,